obviously if it's going to be the first introduction to motion capture, we wanted to really lay down the grassroots. We really wanted to make sure we take a very holistic approach to motion capture. And uh, it just naturally led us to having conversations about you know, our experiences in the industry and what do we need to do a good job in the industry. We wanted to teach the, our students to have the same reflexes and the same approach. So that all starts with really good data. It starts with making sure we have really good reference videos with that data so that we're not only learning how to work technically with the footage, but we also are always remembering to respect the performance behind the footage. The first instinct I think was to just go right ahead and just grab some data from you know, one of the many companies that sell motion capture data. But then the more we talked about this class and what we really wanted to teach, it became kind of obvious that that wouldn't really be the right approach. It seemed very obvious that what we should be doing is getting custom data that was made specifically to, to put the training wheels on for students at the beginning to learn the technical side of motion capture but then also make sure we capture some stuff that's very, very performance oriented so that we can, you know, later in the class, learn how to leverage these new tools and this new technology to learn how to use. V Workshop is a company that focuses a lot of effort on the performance and uh, that's exactly the same uh, focus we have on the class. The nice thing about having a really big space is we don't feel so constrained. If we want to do a dance routine, we want to do a you know, full, chore full choreography of, of, of a fight sequence, we have this huge space, uh, space to work with. So that's nice. Uh, lots of cameras. We, they're using state-of-the-art Vicon, the, the latest Blade software. It's, uh, it's definitely a really good stage. We wanted to make sure we, we, we shot data that, that, that had a company or that was accompanied by uh, video reference because part of the class is about learning how to uh, make sure that the data actually looks like the original performance. So we wanted to make sure we had that. And uh, so they're going to be getting that data, they're going to be analyzing that data, they're going to get that data on a character, they're going to learn about how to retarget that data to fit better on the character, they're going to learn how to leverage uh, the, the power of, of motion capture software to enhance the data. They're, we're really going to give them all the tools and, uh, and all this material is really necessary to really leverage those tools. It doesn't matter what industry you're working in, whether you're working in video games, whether you're working in film, uh, whether you're doing keyframe work primarily, or whether you're actually doing a little bit more mocap work. Regardless, the class has been designed to give you a very holistic understanding of the technology used, the techniques and the workflows that work really well, um, and it's just it's gonna it's gonna make you either a stronger animator, a stronger mocap artist, or who knows, it might even just give you the the the, the, the information you need to just to, to start a career in either one of those two. Either way, you're gonna get something out of this class.